Yesterday I received a request to add the power sequencer to the blender dash addons.org website. So I went to the GitHub and then I checked the documentation. I see there is quite some activity and when I go to issues I see there is help wanted to update the docs and to write a change log. So what I did because I expect that this list needs to be updated. So I made a short list uh, to see what is working and what uh, not. So I made a list of useful shortcuts. So I start then with C. Let's say you have some strips in one channel. If you press C, select strip, press C then you connect all the strips. You can also do that by just dragging. That's by default, even if you don't have power sequence or installed, that works. But it feels like pressing C, that works pretty fast. Next one is Ctrl Alt C to make crossfade. You select one strip, not two, but one strip, a Ctrl Alt C, and then you make a crossfade. Like that. Uh, you can open up, uh, for example, the. What is that called? Uh, another editor, the Dope Sheet, for example. And then so you can uh, adjust the. Um, uh, opacity. Next one is the dog's barking. Shift B. Uh, so let's say you have some uh, strips here. Uh, you need a little bit more strips like that. So. So let's say you want to concentrate on this part, Shift B, box select, and then it will zoom in to that part. You can also press Ctrl and middle mouse button, and if you move up and down, you scale the Y axis. If you move to the left and to the right, you scale that way. And now I'm just scrolling. So, control, uh, middle mouse button to pen. Next is the speed, playback speed. If I press, you see here a menu, power sequence of playback speed, and it has several speeds. If you press uh, 2 and you click on an empty area, you see the speed is changing, press 3, click, 4, click, and then you can change the playback speed. I can also use the brackets, uh, like left bracket click, left bracket click. You see here it is changing. Uh, next one is Alt, Up, and Down. I use the right Alt key and then arrow up or arrow down. So if I want to move this down, Alt, Down key. So I can also use G and then Y and do this, but Alt, and the hour up and down works a little bit faster. Next one is a make still image. So if I could do this one, and I want to make still image here, I go to the menu power sequencer, and then I go to Strip, strip, 
uh, make cell image. I put in the seconds, like two seconds, press OK. And then I should see that there is still image. But for some reason, at the moment, it doesn't work. Not sure why that is. Um, I can, of course, I can try it again. Video editing. So um, I go to add movie. Put it down. Renders. Movie strip. So um, and then power sequencer strip. Mixel image, two seconds, okay, it goes wrong again. Not sure why it is, but um, a while ago it was working. So what happens then, you see this, and then from this moment the picture stands still, and then it go continues. Uh, next one is a fade to the right, fade to the left. Um, it makes a sense because Alt is on the right side and the Control key is on the left side, so it's easy to remember. So I click uh, here, let's say I want to have a fade uh, over there. So Alt is on the right and then F, and I have a fade uh, here. Then, uh, of course, if I want to have um, a fade to the left, Control F. That works. Next one, um, fade both. So F is to fade both. Alt S, snap select strip to cursor. Okay, um, let's say I have this strip over here. And I go here and I think, oh, at this moment, strip needs to be there. I can drag it like that. But easier is, what was it again? Alt S, Alt S. And so at this moment, the other strip needs to come. So I say Alt S. Uh, that was it, but keep an eye on um, the blog on GitHub or if there are updates. And if, yeah, of course, you can comment on blender addonsorg website. I will give you a link on YouTube so you can follow more add ons for Blender 2.8. All right, thank you for watching.